I've made my home in Pennsylvania because of the people in Pennsylvania. It was founded on industry, coal, steel. It has so much diversity in commerce, and of course the legal history of the Constitution was written a few blocks away from here. So between the metropolitan areas, the rural areas, and everything in between, this is why I have a home here. One of the most troubling things that we encounter on a daily basis is the level of frustration and distress that our clients have, and we bear the brunt of that. They come to us because they're injured, they come to us because they're losing their homes, their families are falling apart, and on top of that, they have medical bills and they can't work. Our job is to try to put their lives back together and get them on a path that they can succeed after their workers' compensation case is over. And we always say here that their life is more important than their case. The perspective that I've gained for serving the people of the Commonwealth for 15 years as a judge is something that so few people have. There are very few judges who have left the bench in workers' comp and gone back into private practice. For a while, I was the only one in a multi-county region. And it brings a credibility and understanding that even though there are great lawyers on both sides of the fence, once you've been a judge, you have insight that you can't gain just by being a litigator. We have a really difficult job as workers' compensation lawyers, and we couldn't do it. I couldn't do it if there wasn't a compelling reason to do it. Helping somebody is what we're here for. That's our mission. That's what gets me out of bed every day.